Hi, this is Justin from Hotspot Nymphing, and today I'm fishing Yellow Creek in Pennsylvania. I've never been here, but let's get to it. Today I have my 10 foot 3 weight syndicate. I have a Euro leader on here. And I have a tag system up to my first fly, which is a surveyor. And then to my second fly, which is a Duracell. There's one. Looks like a nice wild brown. He was in that little pool on the far side. Yeah, it's a nice fish. Duracell. That's a really nice wild fish. Yeah, look at him. Nice red fins. This is a nice wild fish. Came out of this, just a small little spot back in here. Let's see if we can catch one out of this little bit bigger hole now. There's one. Another brown. Stay out of there. That's a nice brown. Not quite as big as the first. There's one. Flying fish. Ah, oh, he's off. Nice brand. I had one fish that hit it as soon as it hit the water, like a little guy. And that kind of took me by surprise. There's a nice one. Looks like a nice brown. Yep, nice brown. Wild fish. Ate the Duracell. Yeah, look at that fish. So I put on a squirmy in this larger hole, thinking a larger fly might attract a larger fish. And I just caught this nice little wild brown. He ate the squirmy. So 
So I put on a squirmy. I have it under an indicator. Put on an indicator so I could have a little bit more distance. Plus my arm would get pretty tired holding it out there. I have an indicator, squirmy underneath, and then I have a pretty heavy caddis underneath of that. Well, I hooked into a pretty nice rainbow. Pretty sure he ate the squirmy as well. Yeah, I ate the squirmy. That might be a wild fish. I don't know, does that look like a wild or a stock? He has perfect fins. There's one. Feels like a nicer one. Another rainbow. Ate the squirmy again. Nope, that's a brown. It's a very light colored brown. He ate the caddis actually. I thought he ate the squirmy. I just caught my second little rainbow. Very pretty wild fish. There he goes. Little brown. There's one. Little guy. Ah, uh, rainbow. Ate the Duracell. There he goes. I just caught this nice brown, very nice wild fish. It's a very nice wild fish right there. See you later. I hooked into a nicer, a uh, pretty nice brown. Get over here. Wild fish. Wow, he's very pretty. He took the Duracell, which I have up top now. I put a fly that Lance Egan developed, a uh, Rainbow Warrior. I put that on the bottom. I got that nice brown right before this on that Rainbow Warrior.
that fish came out of right in here and just fish in these little pockets two pretty heavy nymphs on because the pockets are really short so your flies don't have much time to sink so I have pretty heavy nymphs on so they get down quick There's one. Flying fish. Little brown. Yep, little brown. Ate the Duracell. Very small little wild fish. There he goes. There's one. Another brown. A little bit better fish. I don't know which fly he ate, but it popped out in the net. Either the Duracell or the Rainbow Warrior. There's a brown. Uh. He ate the Duracell. Let's get him back. Hooked into nice little brown. Nice little wild fish. My net's stuck. Nice wild brown. There he goes. I had a lot of fun fishing Yellow Creek in Pennsylvania today. I caught plenty of browns and even a few rainbows. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more fly fishing and fly tying content.